are going to learn how to prep garlic, whether that is chopped or minced. This is called a head of garlic, and each individual piece is referred to as a clove. We're going to begin by removing the loose, papery outer skin. Then, place the head of garlic on its side and press down on it. This will release the cloves, throw out any additional skin, or blackened cloves. You don't want to eat those. To easily remove the hard peel that surrounds each clove, lay it on its side, place your chef's knife over it, and give it a bang. Then cut off the hard end where it was attached to the head, and that hard peel will come right off. Some recipes will call for sliced garlic, though most will call for chopped or minced. To chop, we are going to begin by slicing the garlic. Now if you need it chopped, we're going to then cut it into strips, and from there we will chop. Now garlic cloves are small, so be sure to use your claw hand, but be careful of your fingers as you proceed. If your pieces are not even, or you want them chopped smaller, you can use a rocking motion of your chef's knife to chop it finer. Just make sure your hand stays on top of the knife. I find the easiest way to mince garlic is to use a microplane or a zester. Simply rub the garlic clove back and forth over the blade and you will have perfectly minced garlic for your sauce, soup, or salad dressing. Just be sure to work slowly and carefully as you get toward the end of the clove so that you do not get your fingers. You can make quick work of mincing a bunch of garlic this way. And that is how you chop or mince garlic.